Look, you always look fetching, but today it's extra special. I don't know what it is. It might be the dress. It might be the smile. I, I suppose it's your eyes, because that's what I notice all the time. Oh, my goodness. <laughs> Aren't you the smooth talker? Thank you very much. That was good. Was it believable? <laughs> well, it was, wasn't it? <laughs> it's good to see you again. Good to see you, too. Now, I have a question for you. Go right in. What did you do with the zucchini? Oh, that's right. It, so it, sounds, it sounds provocative. Um... No, tell them that you're a gardener and you had, I, you thought it was a large zucchini, I thought it was average size, but it was a huge zucchini and, uh, and you gave it to me as a gift. Yes. And, I, and, and what was I supposed to do with it? I want to see if I did the right thing. Because I, 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 I cut it up and sautéed it. Did you? Yeah. Really? Uh-huh. Are you, are, you, are you being honest? No, but it, I like saying, I, I, love, I love saying sautéed, but that's what I would have done. Yeah. What did you want me to do with it? Or should I not ask? No, I don't know. I, I, I figured it probably was left behind in the green room. It know, was huge. How big was it, seriously? It was, you know, it's like that big. If you're just tuning in, this is Mira Servino. <laughs> watching he's backstage he? he's gonna come out and when, the, when 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 the girls are out here i don't want to hear the word boyfriend so, this is my little moment okay um, can we can we talk about the movie it's called triumph of love and it's quite complicated okay i want you to start to describe some of it and when i'm lost i'll i'll say something okay um the clip you just saw mm -hmm. I am in my boy costume, but I'm actually a girl at that moment. Okay. So um, you play, you're a woman I'm a who... princess mm -hmm. who falls desperately in love with a young prince by just seeing him swimming in the forest. Mm -hmm. And then I arrive to try and win his heart, but he's being protected by a philosopher and his sister, played by Ben Kingsley and Fiona Shaw. And mm -hmm. He is actually supposed to be on the throne, not me. And so he's being trained to kill me. Right. So I have to disguise myself as a boy and break into where they live and, and try and convince them to let me stay. All right, somewhat complicated. Okay, I'm following some. <laughs> this is you as the guy. This is you dressed as a man. Right, with okay. the tricorned hat and everything. Yes. Okay. So I show up, I try and charm This them. is Ben That's Kingsley. That's Ben Kingsley. Now I have to, I have to uh, pretend that I'm there because I'm in love with him. Yeah, this is the guy you want. No, this is the one who's trying to protect the one I want, so I have to try and disarm him and pretend that I'm in lust with Ben Kingsley. Got it. Follow me. I won't have to... Oh, Fiona Shaw. Okay, this is Fiona Shaw. She's the sister. She believes that I am a man, mm -hmm. and so I tell her that I want to marry her and live with her forever, oh. and I end up kissing her. Whoa! Prince and this is the guy you want. This is the this is the one that I'm really in love with. Right. And I get him to start to fall for me. Don't show that. <laughs> um, but he uh, stop it. Stop it. <laughs> He's telling where is he? He bursts in the theater and says uh, phone company or something, right? That's what it is. It's so complicated. You know? It's not really. Okay. It's, it's, it's a girl who will do anything for love. She falls in love and she will do anything, including right. seducing three different people okay. in order to, to get what she wants. Okay. Let me ask you a very bright question, because I like doing that. You're, you're playing a man. Yes. Did you, did you have a new sense of what it's like being a man by playing a man? Did you have a new respect for uh, us guys? I did, because I found that to be a man, you must not show hesitancy or um, any kind of softness or... Mm -hmm like a question in your face you always it, whenever i looked like a woman yeah. when i was playing the man it yeah. was when i was like vulnerable or indecisive oh. so i always had to be sort of very bold and sort of acting like in I command knew. in command mm -hmm. as you are at all moments i don't know <laughs> sometimes during the breaks i sometimes weep i, I go wherever <laughs> i cry but uh so it's fun it's fun it was fun being a man because it, i enjoy being a man <laughs> Did you ever? No, but I like 
like I like how you describe it. I mean, because I always think it's sometimes women will say, "Oh, I wouldn't want to be a man," and they're oh, they're disgusting and they're insensitive. But you're saying it was somewhat, it was somewhat well, like leader it, or something. I, I, th I think it must be difficult to be a man. Mm -hmm. I mean, it's difficult to always seem self-assured, to always mm -hmm. seem like you know what you're talking about. Yeah. <laughs> See, like, like that look you have in your face. That look you have in your face. It's a classic male sort of. Mm -hmm. uh -huh. You know, you, you know, maybe you have no idea what I'm talking about, oh, but you it? have to look like you know more than what I'm talking well, about. Well, at that moment, I wasn't listening. I was looking at your dress. But that's... <laughs> You're a very bad man. You're a bad man. I'm gonna, let's take a break. I'm going to weep. We'll be right back with Mara Savannah. <laughs> Lovely Mara Sorvino, and we mentioned you, you have come a long way in a short time. Uh, do you remember a low point in your career or a uh, bad moment? Yes. Um, when I was first trying to become a working actress, I went on a year of auditions and I didn't book a single part. It's devastating. It, well, it, it, yeah. was, it was tough. Yeah, a year. <laughs> yeah, uh -huh. a year. And at the end of that year, uh, my manager sent me to just go on a general casting meeting with a casting director. And I went to the meeting and I came back and, you know, usually they give you feedback and the manager said, um, Mira, we've got to talk. I said, yes, uh, what about? She said, your personality. And I said, oh, what, what, what's the problem? And she said, well, apparently you don't have one. Ouch. <laughs> I, I, get, you... I guess, you know, I was just too boring or quiet or something. You see, if you, are, if you bring a zucchini along, you're excited. <laughs> I thought you had a sense of humor and you brought the zucchini. I think you're charming. Thank you. Did you fire that manager, I hope? No, no, she's my manager still. She said you had no personality? Well, she helped me. Oh, okay. Now I bring the zucchini. Oh, hence the, the <laughs> hence the 15%. Okay, here we go. Time for five questions. Here we go. Alright, uh, geography. You went to Harvard, give or take hundred years, and what year was Harvard founded? Uh, 1685? Yeah, well, to 1636, give or take 100 years. Very good. Yeah. If somehow you married NFL Hall of Famer uh, Dan Marino and hyphenated your name, what would your name be? Mira Servito Marino. That is correct. <laughs> There's a new cult phenomenon called the Osbournes. What was Ozzy's former band's name? Black Sabbath. Very good. Oh, she got it. All right, don't, don't say it yet, okay? I'm thinking, I want you to think of a reddish brown color, okay? Is it burnt sienna, the one you're thinking of? Uh, I, I, I guess I was thinking more of a yellowish brown color, but burnt sienna is good. Were you thinking of that? I was thinking of ochre, okay, but look, ochre is more yellowy. Okay, I'm looking for burnt sienna, we can't accept that. <laughs> Finally, okay, wait. is your movie, the one we were talking about, more or less complicated than Liza Minnelli's marriage? Oh, stop it. That's mean. We like to think of it as clever. Stop. We'll accept that. that. That's good. Kind of, we'll accept that. Don't you wouldn't do the other one. We had the right one in a hurry. You wouldn't do the nose one. All right, uh, Triumph of Love is in theaters now. Big hand for Mira Servito. Oh,